Hello, my friends. Um, can you hear me, Maritza? Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening. Hello, can you hear me well? Me escucha bien? Yes. Okay, that's fine. Um, so um, using a new computer. Well, it is not a new computer, but it's a different one. Una computadora diferente. So I'm trying to get accustomed to acostumbrar. Okay, so how was your Monday, Maritza? Um, eh, it's a cool. This day is the my daughter birthday. Oh. Ah, your daughter birthday. Uh -huh. So, mm -hmm. did you have some party? No party. <laughs> yes, I don't. You know, it's now. How do you say this? I I I didn't have dinner. I didn't have dinner because there is cooking. They are cooking. Oh, I'm well. And what about the celebration? Uh, right now or after the class? Después de la clase, la celebración, or right now, ahora mismo? Or no, they, they are cooking, but I I have to, to eat in other moment. Okay, in a different moment, okay? So yeah. congratulations for your daughter. And tell me, how old is she? Uh, 18. 18. Well, she's going to have ID, the Dewey, yes. for the first time. Okay. Uh, well, congratulations. And uh, she's, mm -hmm. she's growing, está creciendo. And, well, I know that uh, she's like your baby, but, uh, well, she's growing. Okay. So congratulations. Yes. Congratulations, Maritza. Okay, good. Uh, Manuel, hello. Good evening, sir. Good evening, teacher. Okay, tell me, how are you doing? Everything okay? Well, I'm doing fine. Uh, a normal day, work. Normal. Okay, what what about your 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 illness? Well, you were sick last week. Now, are you one hundred percent okay? No. No. Don't. Well, I don't. No, he mejorado. Como I don't bear, I no. have not improved. Not improve es mejorar. You have not improved. Okay. Well, I'm sorry to hear that, Manuel, because you have been like how many days? Like more than a week, right? Yeah. Well, okay. Maybe you need to take care of that. What about the the medicine? No, it's not working. It? No está funcionando. Ah. Uh... No, me lo estoy tomando. Hey, se come me olvida, on. se me olvida. Manuel, come on. <laughs> Maybe you're taking a different medicine. I guess yeah. you're taking a different medicine. That's why. Okay. Yeah. Well, I hope you get better. Espero que mejores. You improve. Okay. So. Thanks, uh, Emilio. Yes. Okay. Uh, keep on doing. And here we have Carito. Hello, Carolina. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How was your, your Monday? Very tired. Very tired. Yeah, I know. Mondays are difficult, even for me. I think yes. I look tired, too. Yeah, me veo cansado, <laughs> yes. Uh, Mondays are kind of difficult, but... Es la edad okay. también. Dad. Yes, yes. That I know that, that I was... <laughs> I'm getting older. Even uh, last week was my, my, my birthday, actually. <gasps> Really? Yeah. Oh, congratulations. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, I'm getting older. So, okay. Okay. So let's see here. How old? So. You can sing now. Okay. No. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay. Fine. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Carito. And here we have Mercy. Hello, Mercy. Hi. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Uh, you look really fresh. Te ves fresquita, Mercy. <laughs> yeah, you look... Ya más relajada. Yes. Did you take a shower? Recently? Uh, Recientemente. Sí. Yeah. Sí. yeah. We, we look uh, different with a shower, right? Like like fresh and all those things, okay? So, it, it's good. It's good to see you, Mercy. Fine. Okay. I have... Carmen Sita. Hello, Carmen. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Uh, tell me about your Monday. 
a normal Monday, a difficult one? Mm, a normal Monday. Normal Monday, no problems. No Not problem. unusual problems. No. Okay. Fine, Carmencita. Good. Andrea. Hi, teacher. Hello, Andreita. Good Tell evening. Tell me, how was, good evening, how was your weekend? Um, I, I rest. You, I rested. I rested. Mm -hmm. ¿Cómo es para decir descansé mucho? I rested a lot. I rested a lot. Recuerden, a lot es la vieja confiable para no decir many ni much. A lot es lo que aplica para todo. Mm -hmm. Okay. You rested. Wow, congratulations. That sounds good. But, teacher, but only Sunday. Only on Sunday, yes. But yes. did you wake? Did you wake up later? Te despertaste at, tarde. Yes, at nine o'clock. Yes. Uh, you should have uh, woken up like ten, no, eleven. Como el once tuviera levantado. Eleven, like. Ya no pude más. <laughs> you can, you can. Okay, fine, Andreita. Here we have also Diana, que se me hizo esta mujer. Hello, Dianita, se me esconde. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How was your weekend? Um, I'm, I'm fine. Uh, you were fine. Okay. I am um, working. Working. But did you rest on Sunday, right? No. You didn't rest. On Sunday, yeah. Did you work on Sunday or did you spend time with your your, your kid, with your family? No, I, I work. Ah, you work. Sunday. You worked. Wow, I'm sorry. But so it means that you're going to be free one of these days. Mm, tomorrow. Mm, tomorrow. <laughs> so you can you can do some things, okay? So Thank I you. hope you can rest, espero que descanses, or you can do a lot of things that you want. Okay, Danita. So, Thank you. Okay, so let's continue. Marlo, my friend. Hello, Marlo, how are you doing? Good, good evening, teacher, I'm fine. Thank how you. How was your weekend? Tell me, everything okay? Uh, everything okay, it was uh, a little bit uh, busy, a little bit busy, está bien. Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh, and uh, I I could rest too. I on could rest as well. On Sunday and uh, yes, on Sunday I, I could rest. Okay, that that's nice. I just could but, rest on on Saturday, but but I but I feel tired. Yes, <laughs> that, that that's uh, that was uh, <laughs> what I, I was going to say that I rested a little bit as well, but I feel tired. I think I'm getting older. Creo que estoy envejeciendo más que ustedes. Oh, <laughs> ustedes, maybe you transmit the negative energy to me. <laughs> so that's why. No, kidding, kidding. So, okay, Marlo, so it, it is good to know that you had rest, okay? Perfect. Thanks, teacher. And you're welcome, Claudia. Hello, Claudia. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How was your Monday? Very good. Very good. Everything normal? Yes. Normal. Okay. That's fine. That's good to know. Edgar, hello. Hello. Hey, Edgar, a question. Do you work with Claudia, Kevin, and Helen? Uh, Claudia, no. No. Uh, Kevin. Kevin. Kevin and Helen. You work with Kevin and Helen. Yeah. Yes. Sí, oh, okay. Ah, okay, Helen. Thank you, thank you. Chill out. Relax, okay. Aquí vamos a estar pendiente. Thank you, Helen. Se activó, Helen. Creo que anda energética esta mujer. Okay, good. Um, Elsa, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Oh, how was your Monday? Hello. Very good. Very Relax. Good. Well, Relaxing, yes. yes, I like that word. Okay, it's good. Yeah, yes. you look, you look very relaxed. Honestly, yeah, like this and low. Okay, so that's fine. Thank you, Elsa. Kevin, you. the yellow guy. Hello. Hello, teacher. Okay, how was your Monday? Uh, normal. Everything okay. Okay, 
I like to hear that. Okay, my friends, let me tell you that I was, well, the last Thursday, Thursday was my, my birthday, but I didn't told you. I spent time with my family and friends on, on this uh, last weekend. And I feel that I didn't rest uh, as I wanted. No como quería, but but we have to keep on working. Tenemos que seguir trabajando, okay? So that's fine. And we're going to start with, let me see. I was saying at the beginning that I'm using a new, not a new computer, a different computer. So I hope it, that it works well. Espero que trabaje bien esta computadora. Porque, okay, I hope so, hope so. So we're going to study simple past statements and yes, no questions. Okay, you uh, know how to say um, yes, no questions, but in the present. And maybe some of you know how to do it in the past, simple past. So we're going to work with this uh, content today. So we're going to start, uh, remember that uh, we are on the class number um, eight. Okay, I don't know what is this. Okay, yes. Class number eight. So both either and neither are the three words that I want to practice with you. Um, the last module or the last course, we studied either and neither to express um, similar ideas in a negative form. For example, lo utilizamos para decir yo tampoco. I don't know if you remember some of you. ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, I like uh, cats. Mm. I'm sorry, I don't like cats. Mm. I don't like either. Or I don't either. Or you can say, I don't like cats. Mm. Neither do I. ¿Se recuerdan del neither do I? Okay. But in this case, those words uh, can be used in a different form. Podemos utilizarlo de, de otra manera. Both significa ambos. I need you to write this. Si no conocen esta palabra, I need you to write this, okay? Both, no both. Both, both. Both significa ambos. So it says, the two alternatives, las dos alternativas. For example, I want both pizzas. So you can have like um, Hawaiian pizza and cheese lovers or, or meat lovers. I don't know. You can say, I want, uh, if a person gives you or offers you two options, you can say, I want both. For example, what do you want or what would you like? A candy or a candy or a drink. Un dulce una vida. You can say, mm, I want both. You can say, um, what would you like? A pupusa or a pizza. You can say, ah, I want both or I like both. Me gustaría ambos o yo quiero ambos. Okay. So you can say both para ambas opciones. That, that's the key. Esa es la clave. Either. Um, for either, uh, you can say, one of the two alternatives. Se refiere a, si quieres ofrecer dos alternativas, una de las dos alternativas. You can have either a shirt. Le voy a poner un ejemplo acá. Let's say, uh, either. Okay, a candy or a drink. You can say, I want or I like both. No, three ambos. Okay, so um, you can say, I'd like either a candy or a drink. Cuando utilizamos either, también significa ya sea, ya sea o. I like either a candy or a drink. En pocas palabras, whatever, lo que sea. 
lo que sea, ok? And you can say. Y cuando utilizamos el neither, lo utilizamos para decir ninguna. I don't want neither a candy nor a drink. No quiero ni un dulce ni una bebida. Okay. So I need you to, to make a sentence. Depends. You can use both. You can use uh, either or you can use neither. Just remember that when you say I'd like both, mm, I like both colors or whatever. Or you can say, I, I like either a candy or a drink. Me gustaría, pueden utilizar esta, ¿verdad? Me gustaría ya sea un dulce o una bebida. Or I don't want neither a candy nor a drink. Entonces la clave aquí es or y aquí es nor. No quiero ni un dulce ni una bebida. Think about, uh, you can mention a drink, a special drink, a movie. You can talk about food, vegetables, uh, fruits. Okay, desserts, uh, postres, okay? So whatever uh, comes to your mind, okay? We're going to start with Marlon and then Carmen. Okay, Marlon, pick one of these options and tell me. Of course, de las oraciones que usted escribió. Yes. O de las que can... tenemos en la imagen. Whatever. I okay. consider that these, these ones are like easier. Siento que estas son más fáciles. But if you want to use like similar to the image, it's okay. Uh, oh, of course. Um, in the case of the image with neither, this is okay. neither none of the alternatives of the alternatives. Mm -hmm. Neither shirt, neither shirt will fit you. Ni como que ninguna te va a quedar, verdad? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Neither, you... neither shirt, neither, neither shirt mm -hmm. will fit you. Mm -hmm. Neither significa ninguna. Huh? Could you say a sentence by using both either or neither? Vamos a decir oraciones con eso. Oh, ok, ok. Eh, una de cualquiera, ¿verdad? Yes, random, al azar. Of course. Eh, I think... I, 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 uh, ok, I'm going to give you I, time. I, Relax. Oh, sí, por favor. Chill out, chill out. Ok, I, ok. Let's go with Carmen. What about you, Carmen? Do you have a sentence? Ok. Eh, what would you want? A uh, meat or a uh, chicken. Mm -hmm. Okay. And, and the, the answer? The answer, I don't want neither a uh, meat nor a uh, chicken. Mm -hmm. Ni carne ni pollo. Esta mujer está en vigilia. Thank you, Carmen. Yes, so none of them. Ninguna de esas. Okay, Manuel, your turn. Pueden decirme solo una oración, no necesariamente la pregunta. But it's up to you. Depende de ustedes. De cualquiera dijo vos. Sí, yes, yes, yes. I like either a candy or a drink. Mm -hmm. Okay. Y... Okay, that, that, that's fine. Mm -hmm. A candy or a drink. Thank you. Andrea. And then Mercy. Estaba terminando la pregunta. No la terminé a ver si está buena. Eh, dice, what would you like? Flavor, strawberry, or grape. And mm -hmm. I like a both flavors. I like both, both. Mm -hmm. I like both flavors. Ambos I sabores. like both uh -huh, flavors. Okay, thank you, Andrea. Merci, and then uh, Marlon. Okay. Seria, I don't want neither uh, soda. No sé cómo se dice. Yes. A soda. O nor, cerveza. Nor, nor beer. Nor beer, cerveza. Mm -hmm. Ok, no quieres ni soda ni cerveza. You want tequila. Ok, Mercy. Perfect. <risa> Perfect. Eh, Marlon, and then Kevin. En eso estaba pensando. La pregunta, what would you like to drink? A beer or a tequila? Mm -hmm. eh, en mi caso yo respondería, I don't want neither. A drink, a beer, not a tequila. Wow, what a, a very humble and honest man. 
humilde, sencillo, de eso, vaya. Y esperando el éxito. Ok. <laughs> Thanks, Marlon. For your honesty. Uh, Kevin and then Carito. Ok. What would you like? A beer or a coffee? Mm -hmm. The answer, I don't want neither. Uh, se puede solo eso. I, I don't want neither. No, you have to say uh, neither a beer nor a coffee. Mm -hmm. A beer. Nor a coffee. Uh, a coffee. Okay, thank nor you. Nor a coffee. Perfect. Carito and then Claudia. Yo solo hice la respuesta. Go ahead. No problem. That's fine. I, I don't want neither a vegetable nor a pack, nor a pacaya. Pac yes, I don't like pacayas either. Okay. Thank you, Carito. Um, but you can say vegetables. Para vegetal. Vegetables. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Claudia and Maritza. Okay, what would you like a coffee or a tea? Tea, 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 mm -hmm. tea. And uh, después, uh, la respuesta sería, I like, I like both, I like both. Okay, I drink. like both. Mm -hmm. I bought, I, I like both drinks. Perfect, Claudia. Drinks. Maritza. Um, I'd, I'd like either bread or a tortilla. Yes, I like uh, either bread or tortilla. Perfect, Maritza. Okay, now let's listen uh, to Diana and then Elsa. I'd like uh, either a coffee or a chocolate. Mm, que sana. Thank you. Elsa and Edgar. I don't eat neither a ice cream nor um, pupusas. Okay. <laughs> ice cream nor pupusas. Good. Edgar. Uh, what would you like? A uh, uh, pizza uh, or a hamburger? Uh, I'd like both. I'd like both. Okay. Good. Perfect. Thank you, Edgar. Okay. Uh, we're going to work with the worksheet. Uh, Related to the topic, the uh, Friday's topic, uh, it is uh, a puzzle. Okay, and let me see. ¿Quién es la que no había jugado esto? Me parece que es Susi. Me dijo, creo. I don't remember if, if Susi was the one who said this. Okay, um, let's see. Okay, can you see it? Pueden verlo? Let's see. Okay, Andrea, pueden verlo? Mm, sí, pero ya se, se ve como cortado, teacher, de abajo. ¿Y ahora? Ahora sí. Okay, good. So think about uh, some of these verbs. You have to change them into the past. They are in present. Están en presente. You have to change them into the past, taking into account the list of verbs that I sent you the last week. Vean la lista de, 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 de verbos que yo le di. So you can have an idea because it is kind of difficult to remember all of these verbs. Okay? So take a look and try to pick one. Uh, intenten seleccionar. Pick one or three. But... I'm going to check the attendance. Les voy a revisar la lista de asistencia mientras le dan una revisada a esto, okay? So, uh, we start with Mercy. Hello, Mercy. Hi. Hello. Andrea. Hi, teacher. Hello. Uh, Carmen. Present. Thank you. Claudia. Present. Nice. Carito. Hello. Hello. Maritza. Present. Nice. Uh, Christian, are you there? No. Christian is not here. Okay. Um, Diana? Present. Thank you, Danita. Uh, uh, Diego, no, Diego. Edgar, hello. Present, teacher. Fine. Elsa? Present, teacher. Good. Helen, I know she's, work, she's working. Ya te noté, Helen. Present, Jonathan? Teacher. Thank you. Thank you. 
Jonathan, not here. Kevin. Present teacher. Good. Luis. No, 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 Luis here. Manuel. Here. Fine. Marlon. Present. Thank you. And Susie Q. No está Susie. Present. Ah, ya puede. Mm, ya parece el sabor. Ok. Let's see. Sí, dice. Ok. So, Susie is going to be the first. Susie va a ser la primera, ya que le gusta hacer estas cosas. Ok. So, we're going to select one of these verbs and try to fit them. Vamos a intentar de que queden. For example, broad is number one. Ok. Broad. Ok. So, this is easier. Está fácil. Porque ya nos dicen los números. Ok. It is easier. No es que ustedes lo tienen que buscar, sino que ya están los, los, los números acá. Ya. Ok. Um, down words, eh, number one. Break. Ok, I'm sorry. Down. Down. Words. What number? Break. What, one. what is the past? Mm -hmm. mm. Ah, el pasado. Es que yeah. le ah, aquí, aquí tiene. Aquí, aquí. <ríe> Susie Q, sí. Ah, qué fácil, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Tenemos que utilizar el pasado de estos verbos, ¿ok? So, number one, aquí está que comienza con la B. Uh -huh. Ok, I'm going to give you time. Te voy a dar tiempo. Okay. Revisen la lista okay. de verbos que les di, ¿ok? So, uh, what about uh, Carmen? Ready? Uh, 25. Uh, across. Words. 25. Yes. Fly. Flu. Flu como... Como gripe, no. Ajá, como flu, ajá, como gripe. Sí. ¿Cómo después? Sí. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Yes, yeah, that, that's the correct pronunciation. Ah, ok. Perfect. Ok, uh, we're going, Andrea. Eh, quiero ver. Across. Eh, Seventeen. Draw. Is. Drew. Drew. Mm -hmm. Como Drew Barrymore. Yeah. Ok. Eh, Mercy, are you ready? Eh, across world. Mm -hmm. Make. Number. Fifteen. Okay, fifteen. Mm -hmm. What is the past of make? Make. In the past? Make it. No, me no. gusta que estés inventando. Estás de creativa. <laughs> made, made, made. Okay. Thank you, Marcy. Okay, what about Edgar and then Maritza? Edgar, ready? Yes, teacher. Okay, go ahead. Yes, sería uh, number 18 down. Mm -hmm. uh, right. Uh, past is growth. Growth. Perfect. Maritza and then Elsa. Okay, downwards, number three, went. Okay. Number three, went, go, went. Yes, yes. That's it. Thank you. Okay, Elsa, and then we're going with um, Marlon. Elsa, ready? Across world, number, yes, teacher. Across mm -hmm. world? Yes. No, for, forget, for. forgot. Yes, forgot. For. Yes. For. Forgot. Mm -hmm. Forget. Forgot. Perfect, Elsa. Uh, we're going with Marlon and then Susie Q. Um, <clears throat> down Downwards. Down. Mm -hmm. Yes. Number one. Uh, it's broke. What number? Alguien puso un musicón ahí. Carmencita. Estás de enamorada, Carmen. Okay. Uh, Carmen. Qué música y con la pena. No, no, teacher, sabe que era que vi un video de, de lo del sepelio y justo eso han puesto, entonces eso ah. sonó, pero perdón, perdón, perdón. No, relax, relax, tranquila. Quizás ya le toca lo de la canción. ¿no? Sí, ah, no, ya está practicando Carmencita. Buena, Carmen. Ya yeah, repite. Oh, ok, I'm sorry. For number one, teacher, from, for break is broke. Broke, yes, easy peasy. Thank you, Marlon. Okay, we're going with uh, me, Andrea. Me, me, me. Ah, Susie. Susie and then Diana. 
Okay, down 10, uh, find and pass font. Found, yes, good. Ya ven que está fácil, si esto es. For kids. Okay, Diana, and after Diana, we're going with Manuel. Okay, down. Mm, 13, drink, drunk. Yes, and mm, drunk. Me parece que drunk. Drunk. Drunk, drunk. es tomado, bebido, y también así le dicen a los bolos, drunk. Ah, ¿verdad? ok, drunk. Ajá, entonces drunk es bebida. Ajá. Eso sí, ya lo noto. Ok, Manuel, and then we're going with Carito. A crossword, uh, number six. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, new. New, algo así. New, new, como que si fuera algo nuevo, como New York. Mm -hmm. New. Ok, thank you. And Carito, and after Carito, Claudia. Okay, across and uh, number twenty-two. Twenty-two. Across. Ay. Spend. 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 Yeah, thank you. Perfect, Carito. Claudia, and after Claudia, we're having Helen. Okay, across number nine. Nine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, send. Send. Okay. Thank you. Um, esta spend y send, they are similar. Solo se le agrega una T, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Fácil. Ajá, eso pero me gusta. Send. Yes. Okay. Thank you. And we're going with El Helen and then Kevin. Hi. I. Teacher. ¿Mm? tiempo, teacher. Bye. Miren que últimamente <laughs> todas las mujeres me piden tiempo. Okay, Kevin, your turn. Okay, down number mm, 12. Number 12, okay. Right. Right. Pro. Mm -hmm. Road, thank you. Perfect. Okay, and then we continue again with Diana para que se ponga más activa como el café. Okay, uh, down mm -hmm. number two. two. Thought. Yes, perfect. Okay, Marlon, another one, please. And then Susie, porque le gusta eso, Susie. I know, I know. Of course, teacher. Uh, let me see. Number um, number fourteen downwards mm -hmm. uh, from do did easy peasy thank you Susie de Manuel across number twenty seven are and where mm -hmm. <laughs> good fácil uh, Manuel and then we're going with Elsa. Yeah. <laughs> me, me agarraron en curva. Así es la vida, Manuel. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, ¿Cuáles están? Uh, 11, 12, eight, 23, 5, 7, 8. Crossword. Number. Okay, I'm going to give it time. Yeah. Okay, okay, go ahead. Are you ready? No, no, no. Okay, Andrea, are you ready there? And I ah, know Susi era porque le gusta. Susi de Andrea. Ah, that's a yes, yes, yes. Es el que quiero que Susi participe. Okay, yes, Elsa, go ahead and then Andrea. Across world eleven. Mm -hmm. Swim. Swam. Mm -hmm. Okay. Creo que se te, you had problems with the internet. Can you repeat, please? Okay. Swam, I guess. Uh, Diana? And then Andrea. 11 across world. 11. 
Ah, 11, 11, 11. Ah, sorry, sorry. Yes. Stand. Mm -hmm. Stood. Okay. Stood. Diana, then Andrea. Mm, number across number 23. Uh, 23. Catch. Catch. Caught. Caught. Mm -hmm. That's it. Andrea, then Manuel. Uh, down. Number 20, still, mm -hmm. stole. Stole, yes, thank you. So, Helen, the first was, okay, Manuel. 28, across board, 28. Uh, drive, draw. Draw, good. Helen, te la ganaron, va, Helen. Number 30. Seven, ajá. Uh -huh. Across, board. Mm -hmm. Seven, seven across. No, le dije twelve. Ah, twelve. Ah, okay, read. Read, read. Casi. El pasado se escribe igual, pero se pronuncia red, como el rojo. Mm -hmm. Red, okay. okay. Claudia, Maritza. Mm, eh, downwards, number five, take mm -hmm. two. Ok, thank you. Claudia, es que dije Claudia Maritza. Ok, no Claudia Maritza. Ok, but Claudia, yo go. <laughs> And then Kevin. Claudia, not ready. Ok. Kevin, are you ready? No, the chair, I need more time. Ok, please. Edgar, are you ready? Eh, ya pasé, pero si quieres le doy ahora. Sí, estamos dando reprise. Ah, va, ok. Uh -huh. Number 21. Uh -huh. Come. Came. Uh -huh. Came. Thank you. Claudia, are you ready? Ok. Ok. Uh -huh. uh, down, number 7. Ya. Yeah. Ajá. Uh -huh. Como es choose. Choose es igual, solo que con una O. Thank you. Aquí es held. Thank you. Aquí es heard. Con D y aquí es fácil. Was. Okay. So thank you. We continue because we have more things to, to study. So um, now let's continue with tell a paranormal experience. Yours or a friend. De ustedes o de un amigo. Okay, so tell a paranormal experience. We're going to start with Manuel. Are you ready? No. Okay. What a, okay, relax. What about Susie? Okay. okay. When I was 11 years old, we visited, visited right? Uh -huh. Yes, visited, visited my grandmother's my grandmother's family in San Vicente for a weekend. My cousin said that they were, they were scary in there and I did not believe. Until at the time, everyone went to bed before me and I promise you that I are listening to La Llorona. Really? <laughs> who was, really, who was complaining and asking about her children. At the time of the skin prickler, no se acuerda con un prickly, and prickly, and I walk up, I walk up my mom, and obviously she is called me for having stayed awake longer, but wow. I hear that so real. The next morning, I told my cousin and say love, ¿cómo reír? Love, 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 F. love, love, love. Love because they told me that's what normal there. So and then I didn't want to want to go and stay there again. Okay, so that's normal for them. La mm, para ellos, sí. <laughs> okay, okay. Eh, Susie, so you for real you heard that? ¿Escuchaste ¿En serio? eso? 
Sí, pero sabe que lo más curioso es que cuando antes, uno quizás como unos tres minutos antes de que yo escuchara eso, se puso todo en silencio, todo en silencio. Eh, estaban cantando los gallos y todo el rollo. ¿va? Entonces y se puso todo en silencio y empecé que le decía, ay, no, tan horrible, <ríe> te lo juro, tan horrible. Y decía, Tenía gripita, creo sí, que era sí. con mano de la había estado. Okay. Y decía a mis tíos, y o sea, bien feo, y, y la piel rápido, se me hizo no, bien feo, no sé. Piel de gallina, mm, la llorona, ok. Y es, bueno, eh, there are different versions. La llorona, la taconuda, la descarnada, la, la ciguanaba, yes. And all of them are women. Todas son mujeres, I don't know why, but okay. Teacher, la, la taconuda, it's a beer. Yeah, I don't know, Andrés. I, I no sé, mira, sí, I don't know about it. Ay, Andreita. Ok, so, uh, ya vamos, tranquila, ya vas a hablar de la taconada. Ok, Susi and the Llorona, thank you for, for telling that paranormal, paranormal uh, experience. Ok, so I think that was really, uh, really scary. Sí, dio miedo, ¿verdad? Sí, me imagino que... Okay, you don't want to go to pee outside if you hear that. Ni quieres ir al baño, ¿verdad? En serio, desde entonces no voy, o sea, quizás he ido solo una vez más y desde entonces ya no, ni me quedo, ni ganas de quedar. Curada, curada. Santo remedio, okay, okay. Thank you, Susi. Now we're going to listen to Marlon. What about La Llorona, Marlon? Or, or no, La Descarnada or something like that? No. <coughs> Uh, no, teacher. I I really I I I haven't passed. Uh, uh, or no, no sé, nunca me ha pasado uh, algo. I nada. haven't experienced. I have. Uh -huh. I never have. have had an ex that spirit. Uh, but uh, when I was about ten years, uh, about ten years, uh, I remember that uh, too many people was. Uh, telling about that stories about La Ciguanaba, about the Chipitillo, uh, uh, the neighbors or my father. Uh, when, when and once and my, my mother tell me or tell us uh, that it, it was in, in, in Su Pueblo, teacher. In the village, village. In the village, in, in the village uh, where she lived, um, It was uh, very common. about a, 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 a big man in, in a great horse, white horse, and 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 sometimes uh, and they say that it, it it was the devil. I don't know. Mm -hmm. That's some some stories that the, that they tell. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, about a, a, a big man in a in a great white horse, and something like that. I, I can oh, okay. remember. Mm -hmm. But as, uh, okay, what's the name of that village where your mom belongs? Uh, well, uh, do you, you uh, it's Jutiapa. Jutiapa. Do you know San Lorenzo? No, I guess. Do you know no. uh, uh, Atiquisaya? Yes, Atiquisaya. Mm -hmm. Next to? Uh, Más by. adelante. Oh, uh, Pass, pass by is, yes. is San Lorenzo. Further. San Lore Más adelante. Mm -hmm. Of course, for, further. Further, con un further, pero se escribe, es el pronuncio further. Ah, ah, ok, further mm -hmm. is San Lorenzo, en San Lorenzo, you can walk uh, 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 a few meters, meters more and you, 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 you will arrive find, to the, mm -hmm. you arrive to the, to the river and you across the river and you are in Guatemala and you are in... Ah. Like the border, mm -hmm. como la frontera, yeah. Yes, yes. The border. And, and that's uh, where my grandmas uh, lived. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, there, there are some about those uh, scary, scary village. Mm -hmm. okay. Where you wear a uh, hocote trees. Mm -hmm. and you, you, you look about la milpa, a uh, montón de... de de palos de, de, de elote. Ok. Bien, bien curioso esos lugares. Oh, that's why. It's like... Um, it is like... Uh, the, they have like some... Details that they take into account to, to create stories. Son detalles que toman. Of course. Right? No, y además de eso, es de, de esos lugares, teacher, en donde cuando... Para tener agua para tomar, 
había que ir a traer una cantarada hasta el río. Oh, okay. y, y si querían lavar, iban hasta el río. Y si quería bañarse uno, iba hasta el río. Entonces, yeah, imagine, okay. imagine going to the river at night. Mm -hmm. sí. Ok. okay. Well, uh, thank you, Marlon, for, for telling that, the, the devil story in uh, uh, San Lorenzo. Or... Okay. San, San Lorenzo, adelante de San Lorenzo, llega uno al río y cruza el río y llega a Jutiapa. Ya a Jutiapa, Jutiapa, okay, thank you. Jutiapa's stories. Thanks, Marlon. Then, uh, what about Kevin? Are you ready, Kevin? Yes, sir. Please go ahead. Okay, a year ago, this happened to be October 31. I was passing through the park and it was, it was raining at the time. So no one was there. A game was on and I had even the music of the game on uh, and it was moving and there was no one. I don't think it was a joke because no one was there. Okay, so you saw someone, viste a alguien, or a shadow, una sombra, or what? In specific? Uh, era un fuego mecánico. Ah, it was moving, se estaba moviendo. Sí, ajá, y literalmente no había nadie y estaba lloviendo, por eso pienso que no pudo haber sido algún tipo de broma, solo por ajá. Maybe, maybe a spirit in there, okay. Yes, I have heard some stories about that, that uh, it moves. Los hijos de la Llorona. Eh, los hijos de la llorona, yes. Que pues sí, como no, no toparon a, no lo toparon a la Procu, por eso que andan llorando. Ok, thank you, Kevin. Thank you for the, for that story about spirits and movements of the mechanic games. Ok, eh, Manuel, what about you, Manuel? Are you ready with your story? No, nunca he tenido una experiencia de, 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 de esa. De esa sí, pues. Nunca, el día que la tenga, pues yo solo contar aviones. Bro. Ok. <laughs> yes, it can be possible. It, can be. it means that you are a good man. You are very innocent man. That's why you haven't had that experience. <laughs> Pero no has tenido esa experiencia. Yeah. Cambio, Susi, yo creo que ya la debía desde antes, la pobre Susi. Ok. <laughs> so, ok, Manuel, no stories for this time. Ok, what about if we listen to Diana? And then Carmen. Okay, um, I have not had a paranormal experience. Experience, no sé cómo se dice. Experience, experience. Experience, experience? no. Uh, and neither have my friends. Good, neither uh, have my friends. Okay, so you are a very innocent soul, un alma inocente que no debe pecados. Hmm. Okay, then, suerte. Thank you. Okay, uh, Carmen, right? Carmencita. Okay, I, I don't uh, uh, remember having paranormal experience because mm -hmm. my father-in-law used to say that uh, when he was young, he would go to collect sugar cane at the plantation in the beach of Aguachapan. Mm -hmm. And they will listen to the weeping woman uh -huh. and, and take a refuge, no sé cómo, refuge, no sé cómo yes, se dice, refuge, refugio, refuge, refuge. Or because, uh -huh. because in they saw her, they will get lost. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, but uh, did they so, did they see her la vieron alguna vez anytime no just just her solo la escuchar uh, yes they heard okay they are okay so thanks for that and that happens in the countryside especially in in a como se llama in el area rural el campo para la el area urbana we have uh, la taconuda la descarnada or i don't know what okay so thank you carmen and what about if we listen to carito Okay, teacher. Um, 
13 years ago, an uncle with whom I was very attached died. I was in my grandmother's room waiting for the, the body to be taken. When off, when out of an hour, as he says, an hour, sí. mm -hmm. yes, he called me and told me the beans are ready now. Uh, he used it to say that to me every day before I went to school. Okay, so <laughs> le, 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 let me get the idea. Um, there were, were there some spirits? Había espíritus? Or because you talk about some plantations, hablaste de algunas plantaciones y todo eso, right? No, estábamos, no. o sea, mi tío murió mm -hmm. y estábamos esperando que llegara a la casa. Yo estaba en el cuarto de mi abuela. Cuando él me llamaba de una forma particular y me dijo, ya están los frijoles aquí. Mm. Que era lo que me decía siempre antes de irme a la escuela. Mm -hmm. O sea, And, como que iba a despedir de mí. Ah, uh, yes, yes, uh -huh. yes, yes. And you heard that, te escuchaste eso. Yes. Wow, so real, tan real, ¿verdad, Carito? Sí, hasta mi abuela le dijo, no estés molestando ya. Yes, that, 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 that's what grandma says. Ya andate, yeah. andate en paz, ya no estés yeah, molestando. Sí. Ok. Yeah, sí. Thank you, Garito. Thank you very much. So we're going to continue later. So now we're going to study present versus past tense. Easy peasy. Look, uh, we know how to use uh, present, right? You live in Spain. You don't live in Spain. Ok. Question. Do you live in Spain? So in the past, we have to use just ED. And instead of don't, en lugar de don't, utilizamos didn't. En lugar de do, utilizamos did. Y eso es todo. Si se dan cuenta, if you look, los verbos no cambian. Look. No cambian para nada los verbos, right? So, easy. And the other is present. Miren, en presente tenemos este relajo que normalmente, pues, quieras o no, es más complicado por el hecho de que... Eh, Lleva S. Y pues en pasado no solo ED. Pero miren, aquí no cambia el verbo. We don't change the verb. ¿eh? Porque el auxiliar es el que hace pues todo el trabajo. Ok. So that's it. Remember. ED en pasado para todos. Si son regulares o si son irregulares. Y luego didn't. Didn't. En lugar de doesn't o en lugar de don't. Y did en lugar de do o does. Ok. Ya vamos a hacer un par de, uh, we're going to make a, uh, some exercises. So, el verbo solo cambia en la oración afirmativa. Y aquí, ¿verdad? Lo que hemos dicho, ¿ok? So, remember, ed, si son regulares o si son irregulares, cambian. Luego, didn't y did, ¿ok? So, uh, after, we want, ok, here we have this. I'm going to give you six seconds, seis segundos, ¿ok? Go ahead. I can hear you. Elsa, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Elsa. Okay, the conversation about two people, Janet and Sonia, mm -hmm. um, talk about seminar and the experience with two. Habían repartido dos tarjetas, diez personas. Okay. <laughs> fine, fine. We're going to listen now to Mercy, and then um, what about Andrea? Uh, do you make new con contacts? Okay, did you make new contacts? Mm -hmm. Perfect, Mercy. And Andrea, right? Uh -huh. Andrea, and then Susie. With 10 people and awesome. Mm -hmm. Awesome, good. Susie and then uh, Helen. I learned it a lot. 
Okay, good. Um, let's see, Helen, and then Edgar. From small to smart. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. And Edgar. Okay, let's uh, leer algo que decía. Tell me more. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Thank you. So here we have a conversation between Luis and Janet. So uh, let's listen to Marlon. You're going to be Luis and Elsa is going to be Janet. Okay? Go ahead. Of course. Did you enjoy this seminar? Yes, I did. I learned it a lot. Tell me more. Are you dating my networking skills? I learned it to move from a small to a smart talk. Mm -hmm. Great. So did you make new contacts? Yes, I did. I exchanged, exchanged both my start with 10 people. Awesome. Okay, good. And uh, thank you. Yes, we have awesome, que significa increíble. Okay, so enjoy this. Mm -hmm. I learned a lot. Tell me more. Updated es actualizado. Yo actualicé. Mm -hmm. Mis habilidades de socialización, perdón. socializar, network, socializar. Learn, move from small to smart talk, ¿verdad? Que son pláticas de hablar poco a hablar a pláticas más interesantes. And we also have, let's see. Uh, great, so did you make new contacts? Sí, hiciste nuevos contactos. Y sí, intercambié exchange, uh -huh. business cards, que son tarjetas de presentación. Uh -huh. And they say awesome, okay? We're going to practice like in two minutes. Please uh, have a screenshot with this conversation and then we're going with the breakout rooms. Okay, so uh, let's practice a little bit. Okay, let's do it.
Okay, so here we have, um, just to check, um, sort of para revisar, we have this conversation. Mm, remember to say, I need you to practice a little bit. Some of these ways, uh, um, words. Updated. Mm -hmm. Exchanged. Conte, exchanged. Enjoy, enjoy, learned. Updated, updated. Exchanged, exchanged. Okay, now so here we have Luis and Janet. Um, so here we have choose the answer to the questions compared with a partner. So I need you to help me by um teacher, perdón, yes. y puedes repetir la, la lo anterior, las oraciones, la conversación. Mm -hmm. Yes. Los los verbos en pasado. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Um enjoy uh, i don't know what i'm doing sorry okay enjoy learn con the learn updated cuando veamos una t recuerdan que es i verdad updated learn um make easy exchanged con t exchanged porque no podemos decir exchange it mm -mm. ni exchange con d porque no se escucha exchange es Tiene que ser más fuerte. Exchange. Exchange. Ok. Updated. Teacher, pero entonces no aplica para todos la I como ED. No eh, aplica para todo. Aplica la ID cuando termina en T. Normalmente. Updated. Ajá. Y quiero ver cuando termina con T. Transmitted. Transmitted. Uh -huh. ¿Verdad? Entonces uh, ahí es donde aplica. ¿Verdad? Cuando termina en T. Esas para mí son fáciles porque la T, recordate que tiene que ir ID. Eso. Es como regla general. ¿Ok? So, Luis and Janet. So, now. Here we have these sentences. I will need uh, Carmen's help. ¿Ok, Carmen? Pick one of these. We're going to answer one of uh, either yes or no. Answer. Vamos a responder cual, cualquiera de estas dos, ¿ok? Ok. Pick one. And did then Luis. Luis. Did Luis go to a seminar? Ajá. No, he didn't. Mm -hmm. No, he didn't. Thank you. Didn't. 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 Mm -hmm. Perfect. Ok, Dianita. Eh, ah, Luis, and then Diana. Luis, el del... No, Luis Aguilar, Yo. you, my ah, friend. Okay, okay, I'm so sorry. <laughs> no problem. Uh, did Luis exchange business card with 10 people? Mm -hmm. No, he didn't. Perfect, Luis. No, so you didn't. Bueno, Luis. Thank you, Luis. <laughs> uh, Diana and then Maritza. Mm, did Janet update her networking? Skills. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. She did. She did. Perfect. Okay. And Maritza, number three. Uh, did Janet learn to go from small to smart talk? Mm -hmm. Yes, she did. Excellent. Yes, perfect. Perfect, my friends. I think you don't have problems at all. No creo que no tienen problemas con eso, verdad? Del did. Pues está bien, bastante fácil. Así que puede venir una evaluación. Bueno. So, chill out. Okay, so here I have this. And remember, como le, le decía, as I was telling you, verdad, el did, verdad, bastante importante. Y el didn't, okay? So we're going to listen it and we're having a conversation. So I need you to take notes if you want or identify uh, the phrases, words, questions, or answers that you can hear. Okay, let's go. Hello, Genus. 
Hi, can I book a table for tomorrow night, please? How many people is it for? Four. And what time would you like? About eight, eight thirty maybe. Let's see. Mm, we're pretty busy tomorrow, so I can do a half past seven or nine. Um. Okay, then half seven, please. What name it is? Jamie. J A M I E. Okay, so that's a table for four at the half past seven tomorrow evening. Great. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Okay, let's listen again. Hello, Genos. Hi, can I book a table for tomorrow night, please? How many people is it for? Four. And what time would you like? About eight, eight thirty maybe. Let's see. Mm, we're pretty busy tomorrow, so I can do a half past seven or nine. Um. Okay, then half seven, please. What name it is? Jamie. J A M I E. Okay, so that's the table for four at the half past seven tomorrow evening. Great, thanks. Bye. Bye. Okay, let's ask to Manuel and then Helen. What words did you listen? Uh, some uh, words I remember is uh, la hora ya no me acuerdo como dijo ella. Mm -hmm. Okay, and Pero some what? others. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> uh, oh, yes, <laughs> actually, that's a correct answer. Yes. <laughs> okay, bye. Um, Helen, te la ganaron. Bye. And then Edgar, okay. Hello, tomorrow. And bye, seven. hello. Mm -hmm. Okay. How many people? Mm -hmm. Only teacher. That's it. Good. Edgar, and then we're going with um, Kevin. Eh, eh, alcancé a escuchar Jamie eh, la hora 8.30 eh, le preguntaba algo pero ya se me olvidó y al final que le dijo great time. ok ok nice creo que a Manuel está pasando ahí la, la memoria a corto plazo ahí ok good hey, Kevin and Christian hey I call here uh... About things, let's see. Great, thanks. Bye. Mm -hmm. Fine. Christian and Mercy. Uh, I did an update meeting. I was. Mm -hmm. So let's see. <laughs> okay, it's the word of mental activity. Gracias. No, kidding. Mercy. Uh, how many people? Busy mm -hmm. tomorrow. Okay. Great. Uh -huh. Thanks. Okay. Good. Good. And what about Maritza and then Marlo? Um, eight thirty maybe. Um, seven or nine. Mm -hmm. Good. Marlo. Uh, uh, I listen. Uh, can I book a table? And how, how many yes. people is it for? Yes. Yes, that's correct. Como Thank you. Un algo así. Mm -hmm. That's a rest. Do you remember the name of the restaurant? No, I don't. Okay, you don't. Andrea says yes. Okay, Andrea. Uh, Ginas. Ginos. Ginos, no Ginas. Ah, Ginos. Ginos. Pensé yeah, que Ginos. era un nombre como de persona. Gina. Ah, Gina. Ajá. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay, you need to. Okay, good. Dianita, digo, Andrea, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And we're going to listen to Carmen. Mm -hmm. Okay. Eh, le, de, le preguntó de que cuántas personas dijo four people at eight theory. Eh, Jamie dijo que se llamaba. Mm -hmm. Eso. Okay, good. And here we have the conversation. 
So it, the staff is the person who is uh, receiving the call and Jamie is the person who is calling, okay? So Gino's, it's, uh, remember, a possessive noun, como decir, Janiras, Salon, Victoria's Secret, Sandra's, mm -hmm. Moe's, como de los Simpsons, verdad, Moe's, so Gino's, okay? Hi, can I book a table? Okay, we're going to listen again. Hello, Gino's. Hi, can I book a table for tomorrow night, please? How many people is it for? Four. And what time would you like? About eight, eight thirty maybe. Let's see. Mm, we're pretty busy tomorrow, so I can do a half past seven or nine. Um. Okay, then half seven, please. What name it is? Jamie. J A M I E. Okay, so that's a table for four at the half past seven tomorrow evening. Great, thanks. Bye. Bye. Okay, so if you listened to the um, conversation, estuvo todo bien, solo que la chica dijo what name it is, no what name is it. There's un error ahí de audio, but just uh, like that detail, solo ese detalle, okay? So book, eh, it, it means libro, but it's a verb as well. También es un verbo y significa reservar. Cuando vean booking or book, it means eh, reservar. Okay, I guess Maritza is having some fun. Good. Okay. Um, 45 minutes and we finished. 45 minutes, así que we continue with tell a paranormal experience, yours or a friend's. And in this case, we're going to listen to Ana Mercedes. Mercy, are you ready? Yes, teacher. Okay, you Mercy. Ready? Showtime. Okay. Nine years ago, I remember that we came to visit my family in San Pedro Puxla, Aguachapan. Mm -hmm. I was already night and the road very dark. We saw, I had a woman in with clapping on the side of the street, aplaudiendo a la orilla de la calle. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. We feel our skin, no sé cómo se dice, La piel así como eriza. Es la fridge. Uh -huh. Yes, uh -huh. you, you felt that. And like a breeze, como una brisita. Uh -huh. yes, yes, <laughs> uh -huh. yes, we really get scared because we follow it with our eyes. Y no sé cómo se diría, como magia, magic. Like magic. Uh -huh. Like magic in the superior. Mm -hmm. O sea, la seguimos con la vista, pero como en el... La seguimos, pero de repente desapareció. Uh, disappeared. Disappeared. Ah, disappeared. Yes. Ok. Uh, sí, la woman... verdad que sí, sí nos asustamos bastante. Dressing in white, vestida de blanco. Yes. Una pobrecita, mujer. Pobrecita la no sé si es la misma que le salió a Susi. Creo que es la misma. Andaba de pie de soltera y se perdió. Ok. So, Creo que sí. Yes. Ok. Clapping, aplaudiendo. Mm. Clap. Sí, a ti, that's scary. Eso es, da miedito. Sí, yes. la verdad que es el que iba manejando. Dice él que quizás para el susto porque dice que sintió que cambió de color, las manos, como que no las podía mover ni nada de eso. Uh -huh. Ok, yes, te pones como decía una tía abuela, te pones tilinte, decía, que yeah, ahí you, uh, you like frozen. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Bueno, yo durante todo el camino ya no, me fui acostada en el sillón, ya no pude seguir ir ahí por, viendo por la ventana. Really, mm, a ver qué pecado te ves, Mercy, ok. Well, <laughs> no, no debo ninguno. <laughs> ok, ok, so thank you Mercy. Uh, for okay. your story of uh, a woman clapping, a mujer que aplaude. Thank you. Okay, what if we we'll listen to Elsa? Yes, teacher. Please. Um, 11 years ago, my child was a baby at the time of the bath. 
I saw reflected in the door of the garden, a child looking in the corral mm -hmm. uh, of my baby. Mm -hmm. Where I, I turned turn to see, uh, there was uh, no one. Um, a month I back, back, bautizo, ba bautizo. baptism, baptism, baptism. Because in him, and we did not hear or see anything again. No more. Mm -hmm. no not more. again. So after the baptism, that boy or that spirit disappeared. Okay. But I think okay. uh, the child is was an angel from my baby. I think. Could it be? Could it be? Not, not all the spirits are negative, right? Yes. Yes, because that's for a baby. Mm -hmm. And a baby is like an innocent. And so it's an innocent, okay, human being. Mm -hmm. So that's it, okay? But that's uh, mm -hmm. like a different, that's not part of the normal life. Thank you, Elsa. Okay, you. with the baby. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, what about if we listen to Andrea? Please, Andrea. Okay. Last Wednesday, uh, while I was sleeping, I felt my pillow being pulled. At the moment, I couldn't wake up and feel asleep. Then I felt that someone sat on the edge of my bed, and I woke. I woke up immediate, immediately. I looked everywhere, but there, there was no one. Te jalaron la almohada. Sí. Sí. Ya me dio Bien miedo. <laughs> okay, and in at, at that moment, could you woke up? ¿Te pudiste despertar? Eh, cuando pasó lo de la almohada, no, no pude. Uh -huh. Solo ay, solo dice así, medio me moví. <laughs> ¿Cómo dijiste? Ay. <laughs> ay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yes, I, I have heard some stories in which you are on the bed. And you feel that someone sits next to you. También a veces hay gente que siente, siente que alguien como que se va sentando, se sienta y se hunde la cama. So, mm, I think that's really scary. Okay, Andreita. Yo creo que está haciendo brujería por ahí, un tu ex. Maybe. Okay. So, thank you for your pillow. Sorry, Andreita. Thank you very much. And uh, what about if we listen to Edgar? Me da miedo, Andrea. Mm -hmm, Andrea. Andrea, Edgar, sorry. your turn. Okay. Uh, uh, I have no paranormal experience. No paranormal spirits uh, or uh, paranormal stories, uh, no, nor your friends, nor your family. No, solo recuerdo una vez que hablaban del mico, pero no era, no recuerdo muy bien cómo lo. El mico. Okay, um, mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you something about el mico. Mm -hmm. eh, ¿Qué pasa, Dianita? Okay, eh, el mico, eh, it is supposed to be a monkey, but it is like a, how do you say? It is like a person who turns into an animal. Uh, I live, well, I live, well, my family is from Panchimalco as well. So Panchimalco is a village that is known that there are a lot of people which work with witchcraft. Se conoce porque gente que trabaja con brujería. They say, but honestly, I didn't know anybody like that. No, no conocía a nadie. Yo hago trabajitos así, but uh, in my free time. So, no, nah, quieren, quieren. <laughs> <laughs> so, no, but uh, th there are a lot of stories in which there are some monkeys, but they are, they are not the, a normal size. No es un, un tamaño normal. They are bigger. Son más grandes. So, those micos go and they walk on the roof. Caminan sobre el techo, and maybe they steal some things, roban cosas, some chickens, some, uh, well, so, so, some hens, and all those things. And that was very common when a person wanted to visit a girl that, uh, well, maybe a man liked. Cuando un hombre le gustaba alguna mujer, a veces hacía esto. 
well, a lot of stories about El Mico, yeah. There are yes. different forms. Mm -hmm. So that's the same, right? Es lo mismo, ¿verdad, Edgar? Yes. Okay, so be careful with the Mico. Ten cuidado con el Mico. Literalmente, yes. Teacher. Yo nunca había oído eso, teacher. ¿Quién Igual no? Igual nunca había escuchado eso. Yo eso del Mico, jamás. Ya la voy a llegar a visitar el Mico. Me voy <laughs> No, yeah, that, that's for sure. Yeah. Yo prefiero cool. no pronunciarme. Man. A saber ah, qué pecados <laughs> tiene el teacher. No, 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 <laughs> nothing at all. No, there are a lot of stories. Hay bastantes historias, así que yo he escuchado, but it's like, really? For, sí, for real? Sí, por brujería, es eh, verdad. Yes, uh -huh. witchcraft. Mm -hmm. Es como por brujería, something like that. Mi abuelita... Mi abuelita decía de eso, pero ella vivía en Izalco. Mm -hmm. Ajá, y contaba esa historia, ella me la contaba, que, pero decían que era un brujo de ahí, de Izalco, pero buscaba a las señoritas que a él le gustaban y las iba a visitar en forma Y las molestaba. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Sí, y bueno. se subía a los techos y todo, mm -hmm. contaba ella. No uh -huh. sé si lo vio en realidad. Sí, carito. Ahí después tuve. Hola. Sorry. El tío Macario era. Tío Ma... Ah, you know that. Ay, Helen. Cuente, cuente. No sé, está Helen que. <risa> ok, tío Macario, ok. ¿En is he still alive? ¿Todavía vive? Tío Macario, Maki. Se supone que no, y sí. Bueno, con las dos voy a hablar después por un trabajito ahí que me van a hacer, ok? Relax, just chill out. <laughs> nah, teacher. 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 What about, you? What about no. me? What? ¿Qué hay sobre mí? What? Uh, tell us a uh, paranormal history. Tell us, teacher. Ok, uh, once. Um, Well, I lived in Panchimalcos uh, some a couple of years, and I used to sleep in a different room with than my brothers, un cuarto diferente, mis hermanos. And we used to listen that a, a person was walking on the roof. Que una persona como que corría, pero una persona pequeña, like a small person was walking. And we used to go out with a lantern, con una linterna, with a flashlight, and nobody was there. So we entered again, nos entrábamos de regreso, and when we were about to sleep, again, a person, like, walking, but it was not a cat, no era un gato, because some other times there was, there were some cats, había gatos, y se escuchaba. Cuando andaban en Brahma y llamaban a Raúl y todo eso, so, but there are, that's another stuff, right? It was uh, like a real person, but um, a nun told me, me, una tía me dijo that we have like a neighbor, a lady, that she was kind of pretty, era como algo atractiva, and there was another old man, y había como un viejito, that he turned into the Miko. I just experienced that sound that it was kind of, Uh, stressing, era como estresante ese sonido. I didn't see anything, no vi nada. No, no vi nada, but that's something that I experienced, but it is not just like a, a, a big tale, como un gran cuento. There are some people that they say that when you want to fight that kind of spirit, you have to wear your underclothes upside down. Dicen que cuando tenés que, si vas a, a contrarrestar ese espíritu, tenés que utilizar ropa al revés, tu ropa interior al revés. I don't know. Some things like that. Yes. Yes. Believe me. And I don't know why. They have some, like, uh, some, some tricks. Tienen como trucos para hacer. Ok. But. Solo y cuando eso. ustedes escuchaban ese sonido, ¿le daba miedo? ¿O se mm -hmm. le ponía la piel de yes. yes. Kind of scary. Sí. Daba miedito. But we went out in a group. Salíamos en grupo, bien machito. <laughs> but but in, in group, but alone, it was like really scary. Era, estaba miedito. So, and uh -huh, Manuel, what lo happened? Que with... Lo que he escuchado acá, que para lo, lo que mencionaba usted, teacher, es como revertirlo. Mm -hmm. Aquí algunos decían que había que, que uh, smoke, fumar. 
Uh -huh. o, o si andaba algún corvo, pues morder el corvo. Really? Yeah, yeah. Ok, eh, maybe. Maybe there are some tricks that we don't know. Okay. Yes? Yes, but uh, this uh, by the words, I don't know. Corvo, no sé cómo se corvo, dice. Corvo, corvo, it's a, like a, a proper corvo. noun. Right? Okay, it's like a sword. Eh, okay, eh, but morderlo es como para la ciguanaba. I remember. Yo lo leí eso en Con un... dedicatoria. No, sí, or maybe that, lo... that works for just ciguanaba. Solo para eso funciona. Yo lo leí en, una, en un almanaque. Uh -huh. Supongo que es. Maybe. Uh, yeah, probably. Porque Chuck Norris lo, morí, lo mordí en las películas. Bro. Ah, por eso. Hay que, hay que aprender de él. <laughs> ok. Yes. Ok. For the Siguanaba. Siguanaba appeared to the innocent man. Aparecía a los hombres inocentes. Dude. Ok. So that's it. La carita. Ok. Uh, what about you, Luis? Do you have your paranormal story? Uh, yes, but I am not usually scared. Now you're not uh, usually scared about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but my history is when I was a soldier. Uh, every night in is, is necessary guard the barracks, así se dice, eh, cuidar como el cuartel. Mm -hmm. Barracks, yeah. Um, but eh, in the brigade of artillery, in some tower called call garitones. Ah, uh -huh, uh -huh. You know what is a gariton? Yes, yeah, it's to 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 look to be like a vigilant, para estar vigilando, yes. right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Okay. Eh, like sentinels, como sentinelas, right? Right. Yes. Okay. When you are soldier, how a uh, turk? to protect or you, and you change work. You, have, you, have, yes. you have a specific time of hours and you change and you are turning. Yes. And the first uh, the first turn is from the 9 or 9 p.m. at the 11 p.m. p.m. and the next is from the 11 p.m. p.m. at the 1 a.m. Mm -hmm. In this occasion is a my turn to guard and uh, acá en El Salvador en tiempos de conflicto in conflict time on the on the wall of the barracks the soldier shot the guerrillas mm -hmm. o sea, los soldados le disparaban a, la, a los guerrilleros en ese entonces mm -hmm. y among them children and women. Y en ese garitón justamente donde yo estaba, mm -hmm. era que pasaba todo eso. Mm -hmm. entonces, entonces, in the night, eh, exactly at the midnight, I, I listen, children could be crying. Crying. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Eh, I am not uh, usually as careful, so no, normally mm -hmm. no me asusta. But uh, I, only, I only remember that I loaded my rifle mm -hmm. and with my lamp, I searched and nobody, and nobody there was, was there. nobody, no. Uh, <laughs> but in this moment, I just, I, I, you were very believe, scary. Yes, yo creí you en eso. In that. Yes, yeah. that happens. Uh, until we face those situations, we, we don't believe. Until maybe we are in that kind of yes, situation. Yes, but later, that uh, that moment, uh, one sergeant called me, uh, me contó mm -hmm. uh, toda la historia. Y ahí yo supe que había pasado. You understood, ya entendiste, yeah. yes. Yes, uh, I think that that is because of there are some people that they were murdered, fueron asesinados, maybe. Some people say that there are some spirits over there. So thank you, Luis. That's a strange, strange story, okay? Thank you very yeah. much. 
Okay, now we're going to continue with this. And for this, uh, Diana, please help me. Look at the words in bold and complete the sentences below. Okay, so I need you to say at least three sentences, Diana, please. I learned. I learned a lot. Mm -hmm. Continue. I updated uh, my networking skills. Mm -hmm. I exchanged uh, business cards. Thank you. Cards. Okay, cards, yes. Carmen, please continue. Luis didn't. Luis didn't attend the uh, seminar. Mm -hmm. Luis didn't exchange business card. Okay, good. Thank you. Now here we have, um, help me please. Marlon, the questions. Did you enjoy? Did you enjoy the seminar? Continue. Did you make new contacts? Mm -hmm. And did Janet update her networking skills? Yes, that's it. Thank you. So simple pass, aquí dice, verdad? ED, verdad? Eh, si es, ¿cómo se llama? Si es regular. Y en lugar del don't, utilizamos el didn't. And this for questions, y aquí para preguntas, solo utilizamos el did en lugar del do. ¿Ok? Y el verbo no se modifica, ¿verdad? Easy, easy. Piece of cake. ¿Ok? Now, here we have some, uh, what? Here we have some sentences. So, attend is the verb. And here we have the, the sentence. Did you attend to a seminar last month? Attendiste un seminario la, el mes pasado? Okay. So, Kevin, please help me with uh, anyone. Ayúdame con cualquiera de estos. Okay, siempre comienza con did, did you, ¿verdad? Did, yes. And then uh, we're going with Manuel. Mm -hmm. Kevin? Did you meet new people? Yeah, did you meet new people? Perfect. Okay, Manuel and then uh, Diana. Okay, Manuel is not available. Okay, let's see Diana and then Christian. Okay, number two. Mm -hmm. uh, did you enjoy the seminar? Perfect. Christian. And then Carito. Number six. Mm -hmm. uh, did you exchange uh, business? Business. Cards? Business cards. Card, yes, business cards. Thank you. Carito and Susie. Number four. Okay. Did, did you learn something? Did you learn something? Thank you. Susie, five. Okay. Did, uh, did you network in the convention? Mm -hmm. uh, yes. So let's see. We're going to um, ask some of this. Bueno, ya vamos a continuar con, con esta actividad later. Vamos a ver si avanzamos mejor. Okay. So, uh, what's the name of this song? And here we have Diana, right, Diana? This is. Okay, okay Diana, please help me with the pronunciation. Okay, come up to meet you. Tell you I'm sorry. You don't know how lovely you are. I had to find you. Tell you I need you. Tell you I set you apart. Tell me your secrets and ask me your questions or oh, let's go back to the start running in circles coming up, up tiles had on a science apart nobody said it was easy uh, um, it's such it, it's such a chain for us to uh, to part Nobody said it was easy. No one ever said it would um, be this hard. I take me back to the start. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, what what song is it? I I I know. 
I know this song. Uh, the scientist. Yes. yes. Yes, the scientist. Así como lo decía ella, se escuchaba como que la iba cantando. <laughs> Come on to meet you. Y salía así, con esa pausa se escuchaba. Okay, so that's it. Uh, thank you, Diana. So for tomorrow, uh, son, the scientist. Yes, el video es bien interesante. Okay, and let's see today. Edgar, okay, Edgar, for tomorrow. You go and uh, let's continue with this. We're going to see the paranormal activities, but now we're going to practice uh, with a worksheet, okay? So uh, I need you to change these sentences into negative. Easy, that's easy. Because here we have, look, the negatives, the verbs in bold. Los verbos en negrita ya están en negativos. So, uh, tell me, Carmen, what word are we going to use for negative? He didn't play. Didn't. didn't. Okay, relax. But okay. <laughs> ya está emocionada. Okay. Carmen, you're the first, and then we go with Christian. Y entonces, no, eh, no ay y cómo es pues tiche así era así era dale, ay, dale, ¿por qué dijo que... no claro si ya te emocionaste dale dale number one he didn't mm -hmm. no didn't play, what play handball handball okay easy right yes okay. eh, mm -hmm. he didn't play handball okay thank you and we go with uh, Christian. And after Christian, we go with Edgar. Number four. Mm -hmm. They clean the classroom. Negative. Yeah. They didn't clean the classroom. Perfect. No yes, that's it. That's it. Good. Okay, who's next? Can see here? Ed Edgar, right? Mm -hmm. uh, Edgar and then Helen. Mm -hmm. Sería, I, sería la number three. I, number three. I, I didn't uh, make the bed. Yeah, perfect. Good. Helen, and then we go with Mercy. Number 10. Mm -hmm. um, we... Didn't mm -hmm. shopping. We didn't go. Mm -hmm. Go, porque el, el presente de go es when, que se utiliza en la forma base. Mm -hmm. We didn't go shopping. Thank you. Okay, merci, and Manuel. Number eight. Mm -hmm. You didn't. Bu Bill. Ajá. ¿Cómo es? Bill. Solo que en lugar de la T es una D. Bill. Bill. A house. Ok. Good. Thank you. Ok. Manuel and then Susi. Uh, number two. Susan waited, waited in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. And didn't uh, wait in the kitchen. Thank you. Ok. We go with Carito, right? And then Susi. Creo que sí, hombre. Number five. She asked alone. Sería she didn't ask. She didn't ask. Okay. She asked a lot of questions. She didn't ask a lot of questions. Okay, Susie, and then we're going with Kevin. Okay. Uh, Christian bought. A city bought. Bought. Uh -huh. Bought a new guitar and Sería Christian didn't eh, buy. Yes, didn't buy. Buy a new guitar. Good one. Okay, who's next? Kevin, right? Yes. Number seven. Okay, and then eh, Maritza. Okay. I didn't go in Sofia last weekend. Okay, esta, esta sí bien tricky, mira. Aquí va a haber, solo vamos a hacer, uh -huh. mm, sería, 
I was. I, I was. Didn't in Sofia last weekend. Okay. Aquí sería así. I was not. Mm -hmm. Como I am not. I was not. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Maritza, six. The friends didn't go new computers. Okay. Yes. The friends didn't get didn't get new computers yes okay okay good thank you and to continue with the paranormal activity because we are going to finish well in 17 minutes and 17 minutes terminamos and we're going to listen to Cari no Maritza you do you have a paranormal experience and no I don't have a paranormal experience but I have a friend mm -hmm. who lives in Metapan. Told me that uh, they had a tree in the internal courtyard of mm -hmm. the house. Courtyard. Mm -hmm. and, and for a time in the morning, white footprints of a woman appeared around the tree Mm -hmm. uh, until they made a prayer and pulled holy water, they left to find the footprints. Okay, había un de mujer. And after a praise and, and holy water, después de agua bendita y, 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 y oraciones o rezos, it disappeared, desaparecer. Okay, yes, uh, that's really, that's very common. Thank you, Maritza. Very good. And now, what about if we listen to Christian? Are you ready? Yes. Please. Okay. Uh, sería, I was in a car at the at the twelve o'clock on midnight uh, with some friends and uh, women in a white dress ran into her. And we almost ran her over and nothing, nothing, nothing was done. She mm -hmm. just keep walking. Uh -huh. And was that, that was on the street, sobre, en la calle fue eso. Sí, lo que pasa mm -hmm. es que ese día teníamos justamente las, 12 de la noche de Atiquesaya para Santa Ana. Entonces oh. se cruzó una mujer en la carretera en, cruzando en diagonal. Ajá. Entonces, pero caminando lo más tranquilo posible, como que no habían carros ahí. Uh -huh. La verdad es que solo nosotros íbamos. Y entonces, así solo la, la logró quitar el conductor, pero cuando cuando pasamos todavía volvió el para atrás pero seguía normal caminando ajá uh -huh. what about the experience cabello ¿Cómo? largo uh -huh. cabello largo la mirada hacia abajo hacia la calle hacia la, el asfalto y la verdad que no entendí mujer <laughs> ok eh, what time uh, at midnight a medianoche verdad sí porque justo vi la hora eran como las dos y cinco mm. <laughs> Cabal, ahora. Ajá. La hora de los gritos. Sí, la hora de los gritos. Sí. Yes, that usually happens. Ok, thank you, Christian. Okay. La, la mujer caminante. Thank you. Eh, what about Claudia? Are you ready, Claudia, to finish? And then Helen. Ok, Claudia, ready? Yes. Please. Ok. Ok, 10 years ago. When we were at the funeral of a cousin, I was living in a hammock. Amaca is hammock. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can say amaca as well, but okay. Uh, amaca, because I was tired when suddenly at one point I was alone. Mm -hmm. I felt that they messed. Missed me in the hamaca, mm -hmm. and there was no one also but me. Ah, oh, really? Sentiste como que te movieron. Sí, es que justamente estábamos en funeral 
de, de un primo. Entonces, allá me sentía cansada, ya como a la una de la mañana. Entonces, estaba en la maca, me acosté un ratito y en un momentito que quedé sola, yo bien sentí que me, me hicieron la maca. Entonces, yo volví a ver para atrás quién está, solo estoy yo. Y no, no había nadie. Gracias, Lebera. Yes, I think it is. Yes. Yeah, that happened to my father. Él le pasó a mi papá. Uh, a friend of, of him died. Un amigo del murió. And in that day, uh, he was moved in the Maca. Se lo movieron. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay. So what? Uh, thank you, Claudia and Helen. 11 minutes and we finished. Casi. Okay, Helen, do you have a story? Mm, so I buy your hair that is not on the door in my room at mini night, but for space, I first in the grass. Y no tengo mucho, teacher. No tengo oh. mucha experiencia. Okay. No me ha asustado. ¿Te has portado bien entonces? Sí, yo me porto bien. Ajá, ajá, ok. Thank you, Ellen. Ok, uh, to finish, uh, tenemos, uh, we have this uh, short conversation, tenemos conversación. I need you to have like a um, screenshot, please, and we're going to practice. La vamos a practicar. Ok, solo vamos a hacer uh, sí, una o dos veces, ok. So here we have man and a woman, ok. So for this, I will need Diana and Marlon, okay? Okay. Uh, Marlon, you start. What did you do yesterday? What did you do yesterday? Yesterday was my, my day off. Okay, brother. Yes, yes. I started. I, I started the day early and finished up a lot of house, house chores. Chores before work. Mm -hmm. I cleaned the kitchen. Mowed uh, the lawn, mm -hmm. mail it, mail it some letters, and empty the trash, and wash uh, my clothes. I even dusted the furniture. Okay. Wow. What did you do after that? After that, I walked. Worked walk the work because I need uh, to do to do some, some things, things for something for my job. I didn't take the bus and because I look full full. I enjoy the work as I stroll through through the park. Through the park. Through the park, my office. Thank you. Stop. Thank you. Thank you, my friends. <laughs> Solo una cosa. Esa palabra chores, me gustaría que la notaran que significa los quehaceres, ¿ok? Chores. Este, chores. Chores significa, it means housework. Significa el trabajo en casa. Chores. For example, um, what are the chores you do? ¿Cuáles son los trabajos en casa que haces? You can say iron. You can say uh, wash wash the dishes and all those things, okay? Okay, nos quedamos acá. I will need the help of Luis and Carmen. Okay, Luis, please, man. Wait, did you work? It was your your day off? Yes, I know. I did work. Work for about three hours. I checked some emails and finished a uh, paper I need to send a customer. Mm -hmm. Did you work long? No, after that, I walked to my local gym. I exercised for about one hour. I lift weights and walked on the trim, trim, ¿cómo es eso? Mm -hmm. Treadmill. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ahí. Treadmill, treadmill. ¿Qué es treadmill? 
In our uh, list in a world in a treadmill, creo que es molino. Okay, okay treadmill okay. for some time. Mm -hmm. Then I showered and headed home. What did you do last night? Mm -hmm. At home, I cooked dinner and chatted with my room, roommate. After eating, I cleaned up the chicken. I want to watch a, mo watch a movie, but I was too late, so I decided to, not to, all in all, it was a mm -hmm. good day. <laughs> okay, thank you. Es difícil. Como que era traba lengua. Sí. Difícil. Treadmill, oiga, difícil, dice. Treadmill significa, uh, ¿cómo se llama? Máquina de, de caminar. Mm -hmm. Ok. So, I need to have screenshots. Solo vamos a practicar una vez, ok. Three minutes and then we go back. De ahí regresamos, ok. Please have a screenshot. Teacher, las mujeres hablamos mucho. De verdad. Ya lo sabíamos. Siempre. <risa> Are you sure? ¿Estás segura? No, sí. Esta conversación. Ah. Eso es violencia. Eso es violencia de género. Yeah. <risa> Ella lo dijo. Nosotros solo lo yeah. aceptamos. Son okay. machistas. Ok. No. Que okay. relax, <risa> relax. 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 <risa> ok. Bueno, ya estamos listos, ¿verdad? Ok. Esta gente. Ok, sí, hoy en un poco. I see you in three or four minutes. No lo mandó al WhatsApp. No. No le tomaron captura. Eh, Marlo, did you send it to the WhatsApp? Yes. Thank you. Ok. See you in four minutes. Lo veo en cuatro minutos. Mode a saber. Ahí es el teacher que diga. Hola. ¿Cómo se dice? Owen. Así es. Mode. 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 Así, mode. Ok. Mm -hmm. De lado. Mail. Sound leather. Empathy the trash. And washing my clothes. And even. I even dust in the future. Furniture. Wow. ¿Cómo? Furniture. Ok. Y eh, mira, Carmencita te inyectó, mira, aquí, ah, la devolvió la Carmencita. No, te despatado, me dijo, yo soy el hombre. Sí. Te habíamos abierto el... Y sí, vos, vos acabas de entrar, yo soy el hombre, dice, I am the man. I am the man. Y yo así, ah. <risa> Pero le dije, si alcanza el tiempo, cambiamos. Le dije, ah, vaya. Ah, ok, ok. Y le digo, pues va a tener paciente. Mira, mira, carito, te hizo la mexicana. Va. Te la hizo. Sí, mm, mire, no habíamos ni te terminado. Manda. No habíamos ni terminado de abrir la sala cuando. Mira, yo te... Ay, Carmencita, son malí. <risa> No, ya sufrí hizo. yo, ya sufrí yo. Ah, te hizo, no, te hizo la, la, la mexicana, eh, ni modo. Sí. No me bueno. dejó ni que le dijera nada. No. <risa> ni saludé. Ya, ya vamos a terminar. Ya. Okay.
Okay, my friends, we're about to finish. Yeah, un minuto casi. I know uh, it has been hard. Sé que ha sido difícil. Lunes, lunesito. Mm, are not the best days, but we're about to finish. So I'm going to check the attendance list. Voy a revisar la lista de asistencia so we can finish the class. I'm going to Well, I'm going to do it in a different order. Andrea, hello. Hi, teacher. Hello, and here we have also, ah, here we have. Okay, say hello, everybody. Uh, Mercy, Mercy, thank you. And uh, Carmen? Present. Mm -hmm. Carmen. Tiene que atacarme si te denle cuidado, ya vi. Claudia? Present. Good, Carito? La víctima. La víctima. La víctima. Se la hicieron. Bueno, después la contó. No Mar... terminó, teacher. A ver, a ver, le falta. Mañana seguimos. Es que Carmen ya había hecho la parte larga de la mujer. Y se, cuando se va Carmen y Carito, y de un solo le dijo Carmen, yo soy el hombre, le dijo. Y a la pobre Carito me la, deja, me la inyectaron ahí con la parte más larga. Ok, Cristian, hello. Present. Diana, thank you. Present. Dianita, hoy te toca en los 10 minutos, ok. Ok. Edgar. Eh, Elsa. Present. Good. Helen. Here, here. Thank you. <laughs> Kevin. <laughs> ok, <laughs> Kevin, thank you. Present, teacher. Good. Luis. Hello. Hello, Manuel. I'm uh, here. Marlon and Susie. Present. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you tomorrow, guys. Have a nice. Bye. bye. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Bye. Good evening. Bye. Hi Carmen. Hi Carmen. Okay. Teacher, I uh, had a question. Okay, go ahead. Uh, por lo de las tareas de la plataforma. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yes. ¿En qué, uni en qué unidad vamos? Uh, we finished unit one and we're going on finish two. En, en, ah, unit two. Yeah. En unidad 2 vamos. Ya terminamos ah, la 1 y vamos a la mitad de la 2. ¿Ok? Usted, usted nos estaría avisando por lo de un examen de, yes, de, de medio. Sí, yes, ah. yes. eh, sí. Que seguramente lo vamos a hacer. Mm, lo puedes hacer ya. Antes del jueves hay que hacerlo. Antes de este jueves. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ok, ok, ok. Thank you. Ok. You're welcome. Bye. -bye. Ajá, Anita, andas huyendo de mí. No. <risa> Hi. Hello. Ajá, dime. Eh, bueno, tenemos pocos minutos, pero sabes que esto okay. se va rápido. Eh, mm -hmm. Do you think uh, we have to uh, reinforce any topic? ¿Tenemos que reforzar algún tema? Eh, lo que pasa es que he faltado bastante, si es que... Mm. Mm, creería de que sí, porque no me acuerdo si he terminado ya la, lo de las actividades, pero ahora lo voy a hacer. Ok. Ajá, entonces, um, solo una duda con respecto a lo de, hoy vi una pregunta que decía que usted le cambió was not, creo que con uh -huh. ese verbo cambia lo de did, didn't. Sí, esa creo que lo expliqué un día que no estuviste, mm, ya te digo dónde está esto, mm, aquí está. Let me... No, es que no estuviste el viernes, ¿verdad? Eh, no. ¿Qué me vas haciendo? Me dormí, es que vine súper tarde y me acosté supuestamente a esperar que pasara la... Comenzara la clase. Creo que me dormí, oh. no me acuerdo. Pobrecita. Sé que te toca pesado. Okay. Ah, los viernes y sábado. Ajá. Bueno, pero esa mujer es trabajadora, necesita salvador. Ajá. ¿Mm? Dormilón. Dormilona. Ok, uh -huh. eh, tenemos was y were, que es el pasado okay. de am, is y de are. Uh -huh. um, in present we have, uh, for example, I am, uh, I am a student, uh, I am a, um, what, a soccer player, lo que sea. I uh -huh. am. You are. Uh, he is, she is. Pero en este caso, en inglés solo tenemos dos, was y were. Was 
we use for a singular. Lo utilizamos uh -huh. para los singulares y were para los plurales, ¿ok? Entonces tenemos, uh -huh. I, uh, he was uh, happy, he was hungry, we were early, they were quiet, ¿ok? Para el uh -huh. negativo acá vamos a utilizar it, como que si fuera, como que si estuviéramos hablando del, de, de, de am, por ejemplo, tú no dices, I, por ejemplo, No dices, sí, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. ¿Cómo dices? Para decir, Ay, no soy. Ah, pero no soy. Sería, hay... Quiero ver, I am not yes. a doctor. Entonces, esto es igual. No vas a decir, I didn't, I didn't was, sino que uh -huh. igual, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, okay. he, he is a... He is a, a friend. Lawyer. Okay. Oh, a lawyer. He's a friend. Y para decir que él no es amigo, he is not or he okay. isn't. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Bien, ahora si digo he was a friend. Para decir la negativa. El pasado. ¿Mm? He was not a friend. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ok. Ajá, ahora we. Entonces, los plurales sí serían, ajá. We, you, they. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Y se utiliza el were. Por ejemplo, we were partners. Uh -huh. Fuimos amigos. Ah, perdón, compañeros de trabajo. Y para decir que no fuimos compañeros de trabajo. Sería we were, weren't uh -huh. partners. We uh -huh. weren't or we were not partners. Ajá, we entonces, ajá, en el verbo to be... Ahí cambia el didn't, solo aplica para verbos de acción, ¿ok? Uh -huh. Los verbos, ah, okay. todos los verbos, todos, todos, todos los verbos que te, en español terminen ar, er, ir. Todos los verbos terminen en eso, Dianita, ar, er, ir. No, uh -huh. hay, no hay ningún solo verbo que no termine en eso. Ok. Y si no me sí. lo decís y te, y te debo una hamburguesa, pero uh -huh. no. No, no existe. No existen, ajá. Ahora, eh, son verbos de acción, normalmente, no todos, ¿verdad? Pero la mayoría son verbos de acción, entonces se utilizan el don't en presente y el didn't en pasado. O sea, solo imagínate que en lugar del don't va el didn't y ahí está, uh -huh. ¿verdad? Entonces, uh -huh. ajá, sería eso. Mm, ¿Ahí estamos con esto? Uh -huh. vale, voy a probar, a ver si es cierto. A ver, a ver si es cierto. Ajá. Vamos a hacer por lo, por lo menos. Pregunta. Sí. En forma de pregunta. Uh -huh. Vamos a was o or where aquí. Ah, ok. Sería la número uno. Picasso uh -huh. was a Spanish painter. Yes. Continue. There were. Mm, sí, the, creo que there was uh -huh. a, a mouse. A mouse. Mouse. In the garden. Ah, garden. Uh -huh. We were playing football. Yes. It um, was uh -huh. a rainy day. Yes. Ahora se me las negativas. Sería didn't. Sería sí. didn't. Yeah, no didn't. Uh -huh. Sería Do. Don't. Busca en tu corazón. ¿Va? ¿Qué te dice tu Ay, corazón? Yo. ¿Qué? Yo no ¿Qué? Okay. Eh, sería. Ah, what's it, what? Ah. Mm, qué mujer. Okay. Qué mujer, ok. Ok, vaya, sería. Pero es que se ocuparía primero was. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Ah, ok. Was, Picasso. Mm. Picasso was. Picasso was a Spanish painter. Pero le quiero negativa, painter. Denita. Picasso. Ah, no. Picasso. Was wasn't. Ajá. Ah, ya. ya. Was, not. Sí, ajá. was not a Spanish painter. There was not a mouse. A mouse. Mouse. Mm -hmm. Mouse. The mouse in the garden. In the mm -hmm. garden. 
Uh, we weren't playing football. Good. The children weren't in the park. Yes. It was a rainy day. Sí, verdad. It was a rainy day in affirmative. And in negative, it was. Ah, it was not a rainy day. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. Estamos si vos sos bien inteligente, Danita, si yo lo sé. Ajá. Lo que pasa es que... Uh -huh. Me he dormido. Sí, me imagino que te, te, te toca pesadito, ¿verdad? Ajá. Y, todo eso. y ahí okay. hay gente... Mira, y, 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 y bueno, cuando viajaste, el, el tráfico te, te sí. tarda bastante. Mm, quiero ver, por lo menos dos horas. O dos horas y media. Pero ese día sí me tardé un montón. Me imagino, sí, sí, sí. Ajá. Pero normalmente dos horas. Uh -huh. Sí, así, así me dijo Carito, me estaba contando que a ti y a Susi les tocó un poquito más sí, pesado. Sí, estamos más arriba, en teoría. O sea, estamos en tecla, pero bien retirados de la casa. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sí, y el tráfico es horrible. No, yo entiendo eso. Pero okay. entonces... ¿Verdad? Así que, bueno, cualquier cosa, cualquier duda me puedes escribir. ¿Viste? Uh -huh. Sabes okay. que está muy... ah, Te me cuidas entonces, pasa buena noche, descansa. Adiós. Bye.